And over the course of this game, we will prove how much you deserve that. Oh, yeah. You're Alex. I didn't even notice who I was then. It didn't That's even tell me who I was yet. Yeah. yeah, you're Alex on this one. That's what he told me. Uh -huh. You uh, want to go lie down? Yeah. You know, maybe I should. Yeah, little boy. Okay, your comrade. Oh, this is going to be fun. <laughs> right. I don't know if I'm actually looking at the pictures. Or... Oh, this is not the best camera angles. Oh, I found a plane. Well, hot diggity down. Look at this. Alex, come here. I think we got something. We don't have unlimited daylight. I'm going to go help Conrad and Julie with the camera. What you got? Guess what I found. Uh, what have you found? I found water and some seaweeds. this. On some kind of boat, but more importantly, look at that seaweed. Is that not a plane, <laughs> not a boat? It could be bread. both. Kids a whiz. It's a boat of the Thank sky. <laughs> plane boat. We found a plane. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like World War Two. We are ready to dive. Uh, technically, we should call this in to port authorities as an unreported wreck. Well, you know, technically. Are you sure you don't want to do this the right way? Up to you. Wait. Are you saying we shouldn't dive? Oh, it's up to you. I don't know if I want to be a douche or not. I'm saying listen to Fliss. Guys, look, I think we got to listen to our experience. <laughs> beautiful, smart. There we go. Yeah, I'm being a douche, but being a romantic here. douche. If she says we should do things Honey, right... please, I didn't bring you on this trip to get laid. Wait, wait. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. It's not... I, I... I'm just saying she's right, not because she's beautiful. <laughs> I mean, she is beautiful, but that's like a coincidence. She's the captain. Look, we paid for this dive. Generously, we're diving. You're the client. I don't know who's actually but more of a douche now. <laughs> I think I they're both a little bit entitled, there. aren't they? Can you imagine? Yeah. Untouched. People don't know today's word is. We should be ready to get you guys in the water in a few. <laughs> I'll set up the tanks. The boys will do the final checks. Take a look at the camera. See if you can find anything useful. Righto. Hey, maybe you should check on your bro. Um. Um. <laughs> hey, hey. Hey, sweetie. Dude, stop flirting. Almost got the gear ready oh. to go. Oh, Captain, my Captain. You know, we have rules out here for a reason. You guys gotta respect that. At least you showed me a little respect. Even if you're the only one in the group. <sighs> oh, yeah. Sorry about that. My sis can be a little... Uh... Guess who I'm trying to make being a douchebag? The girl. <laughs> There are laws here, and customs. You gotta respect that. These rules are all pretty basic stuff. How much experience do you have with these kind of dives? Hmm. I need some hand in this conversation. No, no I've, I've, I'm alright. Yeah, I've got this time. In all the right places. Okay. Yeah, I got it. So I could have walked across and joined in your conversation. Oh! <laughs> you don't seem to give up easily, do you? Nope. <laughs> For all you know, this could be a war grave. Disturbing it would be illegal and immoral. I'm gonna be more playful. You know, you're even more intoxicating when you're angry. And I am ready to get wasted. You hear your conversation going on. You've never spoken to a woman before in your life, have you? Well, that was a no. dramatic mm -hmm. change of camera then. What's up? How you doing? Sorry, that brewski got the better of me. Hey, well, picture. All part of the adventure. <laughs> well, hello. What's this? Huh? 
Okay. Oh, hi. Hey. I'm going to see how your brother's doing. He's still throwing off. For it. How you feeling? I shouldn't have had that beer. Hmm. Uh. No sweat, Braddy Shack. We'd be hanging up top. Should you care to join? <laughs> yeah, uh, I'll be up as soon as I... <clears throat> Stop puke-heaving. Wow. I can't unhear that term. Uh, I'm making friends. <laughs> Am I sensing some sarcasm there? No, I'm actually making friends. I'm being a good. I'm what? being good. <laughs> being a good. You know, I'm being a good. for a reason. Oh no, I forgot how to use steps. <laughs> the only one who respects the hierarchy around here. Apparently, Comrade's the only one who rec who um recognizes uh, the hierarchy. Yeah, what have you been saying? <laughs> I've been I've been good. You're apparently being the only good one on the ship. I think this might be bogus. I get it. There are rules and laws and customs. Hmm. Experience do you have with these kind of dives? I like that we're actually going around talking with everybody. A couple wrecks over the years. Best way to play these games, though. Yeah. Hey, Connie, how's it going? If this is I'm trying to be impressive. Hey, uh, <laughs> One, why are you acting so weird? And two, why are you offering to help for like the first time ever in your life? Look, I was just thinking it might make a good first impression on the lovely Fliss. Okay, now three, don't call her the, she's a person, not a thing. And four, <laughs> do you ever even think about anything else? Hey, of course not. <laughs> lady's got a thirst, and I'm here to quench it. And what's with all the numbers? <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot. Bro's afraid of math, and that's five. <laughs> Gotta say? Don't be Fliss like this very much. No. So, related, I found Fliss's diving license. Pretty sure it's a fake. Seal's like basically coming off, and there are tons of spelling mistakes and shit. Explains why she's acting so weird. Wonder what else she's hiding. Mm. Yeah. At least we can use it as a bargaining tool if she pulls any more goody two shoe bullshit on us. But my dad's lawyers would love to hear all about it. Everything's going all right, so you know, don't worry about it. Fliss knows what she's doing. Says the guy who just wants to get in her pants. All right, I'm gonna get these rebreathers set up. If I was supposed to be looking at the pictures. Together. Great. Oh, you didn't do it, and, so uh, I was. Enjoy oh, fair enough. For a little while. Yeah, I'm, I'm socializing. I mean, I'm gonna ogle our captain like a great I've run out of people to yeah, socialize with. Gross. Hey, <laughs> it's still gross. Get out of my scene! <laughs> Fine, I will look through some binoculars. Okay. Alright. This is a very, very sturdy, um, tablet, by the way. It really is. There's nothing in the binoculars, in case you're wondering. Is there any water? That is yes, what I'm afraid of. Yes, there's a little of. bit. Hmm. Help, this might be a way in. I'll help you look. There you go. See what you think. Am I supposed to be passing it to you, or are you supposed to be grabbing hold of it, or...? I think I was supposed to grab it. Oh. I'm guessing that one, but I don't know if it's you have to use it, because I don't really have anything else to interact with, I don't think. Dude, this is a lot of war. Almost like we're in the ocean or something. Yeah. Don't trust it, mate. Really don't trust it. <laughs> Oh, and now I'm just looking hey guys, out of the steam. Tanks are ready. Thanks a lot. Get the tanks are ready. Okay. You know when you're trying so, to find, and you can't find it. 
a regular yeah. process setup. That's what I'm having at the moment. That you, do, that you normally just exhale into water, and instead it. it gets totally reused. <laughs> then it is there anything important? Yeah, um, for, because it is still lagging a little bit, um, what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to have it up on the yeah. uh, Okay. Whoa, 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 we grab O2 first. Looking good, Jay. I'd like to take you underwater. Hey, that's my sis you're talking about. You know it. Okay, you little clown fishes. I'm gonna go see what Fliss is up to. You behave, Connie. Hey. Looking for a first mate, Captain? You need look no further. You just don't give up, do I you? I will like, never give up. <laughs> like, I know the weight is interminable, but soon, soon it'll just be you and me. Out of the frying pan? All right, Camera, kids. I'll take the wheel. Good Let's to get go. a before photo. Just remember the rules, please. I keep. No, I get that <laughs> feeling. I don't know why. It seems so friendly together. I'm gonna miss you, comrade. I liked being a friendly person, yet a douche at the same time. <laughs> so I'm assuming that means I'm going to be comrade now then, right? Because I've never uh, actually seen uh, this part from a different perspective. Like well, I said, I've never actually been on the water, so... No, like, because I did it last time. So basically, yeah, it's a total role reversal to last time. Yeah, yeah. So again, if you guys want to see what it looks like the other way, look at uh, our previous playlist of this. I thought that was the plan. I thought I was going to ransack the plane. It's not like one tiny little thing would hurt anybody. <laughs> I won't tell if you won't. <laughs> it's not like they can scan the wreck every night at sundown. There. That shape. That's got to be it. Whoa. That is, like, way bigger than I thought. Damn. It's pretty intact, too. This is a fucking remarkable find. Let's swim around a little and find a way in. Conrad said one of the pictures showed an opening. Conrad, really? Really. With a rear turret. Huh. Good on ya, Connie. Doopy doopy doop. I've been to... You're Fliss. The turret. Uh, you can get in through there. I am Fliss. I'm Julia, I think. Go for the spiky thing. Oops. Ah, fuck. I'm hurt. Wow. Careful. Could be dangerous. Uh, ladies first? <laughs> Can I just take a second to say, holy shit, Alex, we did it. I mean, can you believe it? It's a dream come true. <laughs> Let's not waste any time not exploring. Go, go, go. I really do not feel comfortable with this. I've got a feeling something's going to jump out at me and I'm not going to be Even, feeling happy with this. You'd have to take your gear off <laughs> to get in there. Not worth it. That pipe's pretty tight. What if you get stuck without your rebreather? You know what? I'm not Maybe it is kind of dangerous. I got some achievement, by the way. What did you do? Conrad successfully flirted with a fist. Yay! Fist? I don't know if you're getting the achievements too, or if it's only me. Well, uh, I'm not. But then again, I could have probably already found it. Oh, I found a secret. All down the fuselage. Brad's gonna flip when he sees this. Check it out. 
They reconfigured the bomb rack to hold lifeboats. Interesting. That they knew what they were One doing. One of the rescue boats is missing. Think they were using it? Let's see what else we can find. I'm not a huge fan of diving. Uh, <laughs> I'm just fiddling with things now. I'm trying to call you two on the radio and you're not responding to me. <laughs> <gasps> Zombie! Ugh. Ugh. He's holding something. Oh. oh. Sorry. Didn't didn't press pause. Don't know what happened there. It's alright, but I'm holding something and it looks like a very oh. nice picture. Here. And we'll look at things. They knew they were goners. He's holding something. I've already looked at this, but I'm going to look at it again. Put back down. There you go. It's a nice picture. Uh, you hear that? Let's check it out. Don't trust it. Oh, this is gonna go bad for me. <sighs> it's a zombie with a gun. <laughs> Stupid eel! I knew it was gonna be the eel. Oh god, that is not fun. I knew that one was coming as well because I remembered that one. Oh, uh, I knew there was something that was ju that jump scared you, but I don't remember when. It was then. Yeah, I know. Now. Made me scream, I think. Yeah, it's nice to know that we both reacted the same way when we did this. Because I'm pretty sure I actually properly jumped. Oh yeah, I did too. Easy now. This stuff's been down here a long time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh. Julia! Oh my god! Just don't touch anything else, please! Well, apparently I'm in debt. You're in what now? A massive amount of debt. That's not good. He's holding something. And they're gonna foreclose on my... On my boat. Oh dear. So basically, the only reason it looks like I took this trip was um so that I don't lose my boat. Ah. So I have to pay like 3000 by the end of the month, and this obviously is... I think they pay me like five grand for this trip. We're going on, a said on the note. trip. Let's be... oh. oh, I found a picture. Hmm. Okay. I said the premonition stuff doesn't always, uh, Give me an idea of what I'm supposed to be doing because you're gonna forget it by the time it comes up. I'm coming for my swims because I don't know what I'm doing down here. <laughs> oh, there we go. Mate, what's happening up there? Oh, we gotta get out of here now. A piece of paper. Oh, shot nearly took my paper. Oh god, Alex. It's a grey reef shark. Not interested in us. Let's go. Oh damn you grey reefs. Hold on. Uh oh, okay. Thought this was the right time, but then didn't know if it was the right time. Come on, it's so annoying. No They're just throwing water right into the, the money into the water. Yeah, told you. Hold thirty bucks. Oh, I 
know you can't tell because we're underwater, but I'm on my knees right now. Uh-huh. Julia. There was no trigger for him doing that at all. I... I... Oh, crap. I, Alex, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I mean, I, I just... I mean, we almost just died. Julia, I'm serious. Take it. Alex, wow. What a oh, my bearing story. dated. How's it end? That was different. Yes! Hero. You want to get on with our escape from the uh scrum? It just said hashtag wink. Oh, what? who says that? Yeah, yeah. I just We're got an achievement. Who do you think? I know who said what? it, but uh Julia accepted oh yeah, I accepted the proposal. Ah, so I'm guessing it's separate then, because I got that one last time, so I'm guessing it's just dependent on who's doing the Wait. you know Julia. Which I think is wrong. I think it should be both of us should get the achievement. Oh, Damn. Oop. What, the fuck? what happened? Conrad we, we tried lighting a barbecue. Oh. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, my brother's up there. Dude, really? Oh my god, this is taking too long, this is torture. Just a few more seconds. Okay, now, go, go! Uh, Max, Conrad and Flitter's relationship. Nice. Yes! 50 gamer score! Yep, I got it too, mate! Awesome! Woo! Hey, what the hell is Yeah, I've been, I've been busy what while you've been happened? gone. It's cool, man. They're now it's getting right, on man. very well. There was a huge explosion! There was that too, but we still got And money and in the water. Ignore that. There was a little, uh, mishap with the barbecue. Mm. Jesus, looked like the whole boat was lit up. I like the way the brother didn't even hear this, by the way. Yeah. He's not even come so up yet. why are you paying the ocean? Yeah, why are you paying the ocean? <laughs> a fishing boat came by and got damaged on the dive line. Oh, that's what happened. Yeah. They were being a little surly about it, so Conrad made it rain and they pissed off. <laughs> Whatever. Who cares, right? <laughs> what I want to know is, what you guys find? Well, we found the plane, and it is huge. Full of cool stuff. Oh my god, you guys! Can you all just shut up for like one second? Holy shit! On the plane. Dude, oh, <laughs> crap! Nice <laughs> done. Come up and let's celebrate. Dirty, no one's actually going to ask that question. <laughs> they were well, talking about there's a load that? of cool shit on the boat. Look what I got! <laughs> hey, Clive! He looks annoyed with us. Yeah, he does. yeah I... you're getting to know these intrepid so adventurers then with... alex and his little brother brad trying to swim with the big fish both seem out of their depth and julia the love of alex's life and he the love of hers what about conrad a bold fellow you might say i think we've already said what or we think of him you'd say arrogant i was thinking of another <laughs> word and then there's captain fliss Strong, forthright, stubborn. Do I detect a spark between her and Conrad? We try. <laughs> I'm trying my best. Let me reassure you. You help them to make some decisions they'll value. I'm just trying on. to play this a little bit different to last time. Yeah, I am as well. But I think it's because we do, we are taking different roles as well. We kind I of... I think so. And it's also the fact that we know what we're trying to avoid. Oh, yeah, yeah. Which, truthfully, I think there's only one thing we need to avoid in the earliest part of the game, and then at the end it's specific. Comrade. Yeah. <laughs> but, like, so if, you, we're if we're like looking back, last time we were nearly well, good. Certainly, yeah. I mean, nearly. Relevant. And this meatball... Meatball? This meatball pulls a ring out of God knows where. Yeah, where did you hide the ring? A lady never tells. Well, needless to say, this yeah, Where did you hide the ring? Well, played everyone, no? Wasn't Conrad going to get us some more beers after he helped Fliss? Maybe he decided, hey, I'll drink some, and then he got drunk. And since he was drunk, he forgot to bring it to us. And he just kept on drinking, and he drank all of it. Uh, sounds like you've had some experience with this kind of phenomenon. Yeah, I've been studying it for years. I'll go look for him. 
Oh, we found a bullet lodged in the plane. Huh. I left it below deck if you want to check it out. Yeah. Thank Wait, you. Who's who's going to shoot check? Wait, who so, am I? Me. How does it I'm going to look. Be You're Julia, Julia, I think. Julia Smith. Okay. I'm just gonna look through your camera Honestly, quickly. I wasn't sure how See it what feels, pictures you took. But now that I hear it, it does have a nice ring. Found a couple of secrets. So I guess we should talk about wedding plans. Eventually. Found a lot of secrets. <laughs> mm. Now you're speaking my language. I'm taking lessons. Yeah, I can't wait for us to plan everything together. I was so worried you might say no. I was surprised, you know? I kinda wasn't sure how to respond. Julia, is there something we need to talk about? Oh dear. Oh. Oh my god. I walked Alex. in on Fliss and. I was just shook up from the plane falling apart around us. That's Fliss and Conrad. No biggie. Okay, cool. Cool. What's up with that? Oh, um, they were, um, Everybody. enjoying each other's company. Oh, man, oh wow. That is not a cool thing to do. Yeah. Sorry. Dude, didn't what did you do? Interrupt. Oh, yeah, the beers. I was just getting them now. <laughs> <laughs> what is going on down here? Nothing to worry about, sis. Just getting them beers. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah, I kind of walked in on them, I'm afraid. As long as they, they were making friends. <laughs> very, very close friends, yes. Exactly. All right, now that everybody's here, let's take a look at the <gasps> Do I get to tell the story this time? Maybe we can yeah, you figure do. out why the plane was out here. Where'd you put it? It's in your case. Okay, I'll go get it. Hey. What's up? Congratulations again, dude. Seriously. I'm really happy for you guys. Mm. I can't believe I actually did it. Why'd you do it on the dime? I wanted it to be memorable. It's not that memorable. Uh, I have to hand it to you. What the stuff? On the bottom of the ocean like that, it's pretty romantic. Imagine if the ring had floated away, though. Could you imagine? What's that? The ring? Oh, that would Imagine if the ring, like, when you proposed underwater, imagine if it just floated away. Oh man, I'm just looking through the photos at the moment. One, I'm not that sappy. Two, I was talking about med school. Still, we're over the top, bro. So, what am I fetching again? Tomorrow? Um, I think it was something from your room, isn't it? Probably. Can't wait to see this sucker for myself. This up, Polo. I'm gonna go find Julia. You don't have to find me. I'm fine. Hey, almost time for barbecuing. Got the pad yet? Oh no, not yet. I got distracted. I was looking at things. Got it. Let's go up. Come here, you vixen. Easy, tiger. We should get back. <laughs> what? Right what are you here. doing? So, um, Brad just said I don't get what the big deal is about girls, and Fliss looked and went, well, they are quite good in bed. All right, then. <laughs> I like Fliss. <laughs> <laughs> Weird conversations going on up here. There. All right, everyone. Don't worry, me. I was looking at them. Oh. Manchurian gold. Oh. Lots of oh. Treasure. So what do you think? Imagine if you could just credits. say, no, let's not go. End of story. Or... Credits roll. Maybe the plane's destination? You think we could get there by tomorrow? It takes a couple hours if the weather stays steady. Wow. Do you find anything else? Manchurian gold. This plane must have been shot down because it was riddled with bullet holes. I found one lodged in the fuselage. Huh. And it was full of life rafts. Must have gotten shot down before they could deliver all the rafts. There was only one missing. From the photos Alex took, you can see the flight badge on one of the corpses. That means the crew was from Conwyn Island, smack dab in the middle of the Pacific Theater. It's a fair. Reckless, all of you. Excuse me? I told you to leave everything down there alone. Oh, come on. We've been through this already. I'm not talking about the law. What are we talking about? No, hey. They were respectful. No, you did whatever you wanted. 
Whatever you took, it was too much. Oh, are you gonna be? <laughs> You're right. We should have been more careful. Oh. That's not me, I'm sorry. Why did I get the thing that was really sarcastic, okay. he said? Maybe. Because it was. <laughs> I don't know you. You should have never gone down to that plane in the first place. It's bad luck. You think you can scavenge down there and it makes no difference, but every single thing you bring back has an essence. It's like a ghost you invite to the surface. Here we go. Huh. I never thought about it like that. You never think about much of anything. Well, maybe I never heard about such cool ghost stories. They're not cool ghost Let's stories. Let's talk about ghost stories. Not like for fun. <laughs> People drown in these waters and you have to respect their resting place. Damn straight. Fred, you got a fun ghost story, right? A fun one. Really, really, really we're going from this. Y yeah, I heard a story. It happened right around here, too. Let's hear it. We could all use a good show. Oh, I really want to make a stupid story now. Let's do it. Let's hear it. I bet you can spin a good yarn. What do you want? Scary story or not so scary? It's your choice, mate. <laughs> Scare oh. away, little bro. <laughs> okay. Here goes. This story is true. It had happened right near here. In an old lighthouse. Classic setup. In the middle Wait. of the ocean. True yeah. story? Where'd you hear this? Internet? <laughs> oh, what's... Ah, well... Down by the dockside, I found an ancient old man, skin like a leather book, eye patch, wooden leg, the whole nine yards. And for a dollar, he told me his secrets. Seems legit. It's the cheap. lighthouse stood atop an atoll, <laughs> isolated from the rest of the world, a lone beacon in the night, a sailor's respite. The lighthouse keeper would hear the waves pounding the rocky shore. One misty morning, he comes upon a woman covered in blood. She's stumbling down the beach. He hurries to her aid, and she falls into his arms, sobbing. As he hurries her back to the lighthouse, he asks where she's from. He doesn't waste any time. Smooth. <laughs> he of the one-track mind. The woman answers, I live here, in the lighthouse. My parents are upstairs right now. Twist. Of course, the lighthouse keeper says, that isn't so. Of course, he's lived there alone for years. And the woman becomes hysterical and his sister parents are upstairs. So, they go to the top of the lighthouse, and there, splayed down on the floor, is a man and a woman brutally murdered with an axe. Always an axe. I mean, do people even use axes anymore? I know, come on. Be a little bit more clever with it. <laughs> okay. Okay, fine, then it, it was a meat hook. They Change your mind. With a meat hook, and hung from the rafters. What does he know the fact that just changed Wait a the story? Minute. Are you changing the murder weapon? <laughs> I'm not. Ch uh, no, no, no. A lot of blood, a lot of carnage. Who's to say how it was done? Okay, so who did it? It was the butler. <laughs> the woman says, "It was my brother," and she turns to the closet and says, "He's hiding in there." Oh, great. Blame the brother. Yeah. Where's the brother? So the lighthouse keeper creeps over to the closet opens the door and sure enough there's a man inside <gasps> but he sliced out his own insides with a meat hook oh so that's where the meat hook went he looks definitely a meat hook see the dead man's yeah. face in the dark closer closer and he sees it's his own face and then its eyes bulge out and screams <laughs> well yeah, that was uh, uh, gross. Hell, super twist nice <laughs> that was conveniently timed. I know. Oh, you don't look impressed. It wasn't scary. Oh, come on. That wasn't scary. <laughs> Get me on the cheese there, corn dog. Okay. You've all had your fun. We should all turn in. There's some weather hitting our way. Uh uh. No, no, no. No, because according to standard vessel regulation, we're all required. One more beer before hitting the hay. What regulations are these? A lot of these regulations. Standard issue <laughs> regulatory institutional protocol subdivision 1099. Uh huh. Thou shall not said. sleep with a goat. Oh, so you found a website. <laughs> beer under every circumstance. Just following orders, man. I'm into this website. <laughs> 10 4, good buddy. And I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> 